The night of activism and glamour. The Golden Globes made a pretty powerful statement against sexual harassment. Many stars showed up in black to show their support. And CBS 2's Cara Finstrom is here live to tell us all about it. Cara? They did. You know, Hollywood's been focused on bringing about change for months now. So last night, Oprah Winfrey used that award spotlight to voice what everyone has been thinking. There are so many women who've endured so much and remained silent and kept going because there was no other recourse. And now that we've all joined as one voice, uh, I think that those, it, 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 it is, feels like um, empowerment to those women who never had it. That was Winfrey backstage. When she received the Cecil B. DeMille Award, she also called out sexual harassers around the world, saying their time has come. Hollywood's elite, as you mentioned, dressed in all black, showing their solidarity for this movement. Some actors even swapped their traditional white tuxedo shirts for black ones. Many celebrities are also backing a new initiative called Time's Up. This aims to help women across the country fight harassment in workplaces. The effort includes a legal defense fund and proposed legislation that would punish companies that allow continued sexual harassment. Here's what some of Hollywood's other leading ladies had to say last night. It feels powerful. It feels like a collective. But it also allows us to speak and be heard, and as Reese was saying, to be heard and to be seen and to stand up for um, what this show is about. Some stars wore pins with the words Time's Up printed on them. It has become a new internet hashtag that's being used to call for an end to harassment and mistreatment of women yeah. in workplaces. Sure. Really Indeed. catching on.